Tremendous. Enormous. Amazing. Infamous. Constant. Wow. Wow. Great. So sick. <laughs> Hi, my name is Justin Singh, and I sing and play guitar in Anti-Flag. My name is Chris Tu. I sing and play bass in the band Anti-Flag as well. Oh, the internet, easily. No problem. Uh, yeah, I give, I give up music for a month. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually really true. Yeah. I've, I've played a lot of music in my life. Yeah. I give it up for You're a ready. month. I've given up the internet for long periods of time. Usually not by choice, but as it goes on, I find that I don't miss it at all, which is amazing. You think I would, but I, I just don't. I've been to islands where there's no internet, and after a couple of days, you don't even think about it anymore. But I, I definitely think about music in that time. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah. It's not. We need I it. I did it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> that, that said, I'm still addicted to the internet. Fuck you. I will always be the funniest person in the room. He will always be the funniest person in the room. And I will never be the most intelligent. So <laughs> that, that's just life. Sometimes you have to accept it and move on. rather have a dog with a cat's personality because I kind of have that now. Um, uh, I have a pug and as pugs get older they start to slow down and only want food and only care about you when you have food. So that's that's my type of animal. Um, uh, whereas if a cat was like a dog and it could like jump on your counter and steal food the way a dog does, that seems like a terrible predicament to be in. <laughs> Yeah, that's true. I, I hadn't really thought of it that way. Yeah. I was going to go the opposite direction. But, um, you know, though, I've always thought it would be really cool to, because cats can take care of themselves. Like you can leave home for four days and leave some, some food and water out and the cat's not going to die where a dog would just starve to death because it would eat all the food the minute you left. Um, so I always thought it would be kind of cool to have a small dog but that had a cat's person or a small cat that had a dog's personality so i don't know baby legs or a baby head Fuck. um yeah. well i mean I'm i feel like, like the baby legs there's yeah. something cool about this if you had baby this. legs people might be like oh that's a that's a cute little baby yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> Give me the alien invasion. Yeah, aliens. I want to see how that goes. You know, the zombie apocalypse, I can kind of, I, I kind of can figure that one out. Like, we kind of know it's just going to be dirty and ugly and brutal. The aliens might bring some shit that we just haven't even begun to think about. I have a feeling I could make peace with an alien. I don't think I could ever make peace with a zombie. You think that you could, you could connect telepathically yeah, yeah. and you could be like, yo, let's talk about this yeah. telepathically. I want to see the alien technology bring it. Um, I feel like um, the future, because 100 years ago in the past uh, was pretty uh, terrible. Um, <laughs> both, uh, it really was an awful time. Yeah, yeah. It just, it's just like uh, uh, I know that we have um, immense issues uh, facing us right now, but I'm an optimist so that I, I believe 100 years in the future we're going to be progressing as societies versus 100 years in the past. Um, it was just a bunch of ignorant, racist pieces of shit, and so I'm okay if we leave them in the past. Yeah, hundred percent. And I and I'm really interested to see where we go in the world. You know, I know that there are a lot of obstacles that we have to overcome, and we have a lot of problems. But in the end, I am an optimist, and I I have to believe that it's going to get better. I have to believe that humans will act to save the planet. That humans will work for social and economic justice. And I believe that. I, I want to see where we go. And two skinny guys like us wouldn't survive 100 years ago uh, if we had to, like, hunt for our own oh food or whatever. Yeah, that'd be terrible. Yeah. <laughs> Awful hunters. Yeah. Um, I think that uh, uh, I, in the future, I'm most curious to see how we get out of the corporate rut we're in and how we uh, put more emphasis on human life than we do on money. Uh, I'd like to see a progression happen there. Um, in the past, 
I'm just curious to see how people survived, how they did it. Um, yeah, I mean, just seeing the day, day-to-day life in the past, because just the way people heated their homes and things like that, it was yeah. so different. The way people uh, prepared food, I mean, it, 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 it's really amazing when you look. But we've already established I can't go a month without the internet, so I don't have any time <laughs> yeah. in the past. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs>